everybody jeff aka g curse here and boy oh boy oh boy oh boy do i have a special one for you today as always if you like this video which i hope you are because i'm gonna be laughing my ass off feel free to click that subscribe button let's get uh dsp to feel a little bit more felted that the detractors are always just having fun at his expense anyway with that said the video I'm reacting to today, it is actually not a Phil Burnell video, but it is in the Phil Burnell uh, universe, I guess you could say. Now, I saw this. This appeared on my uh, YouTube uh, homepage, and I was kind of like, huh, okay, let's see. Let, let's take a look at it. From Almighty Loser... I'm going to be re uh, reacting to one of the segments in the DSP hunt, number one, Pimpin' Pat. Now, like I said, I really don't know that much about these guys. I, I only know about Derek because he's a pedophile. I know about Jade because apparently he lives in a wheelchair. You know, I, 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 remember, I know about OIC because apparently he likes to cross-dress as a bunch of girls. I've never heard of Pimping Pat, but holy shit, <laughs> holy shit, this guy, if, if there is ever a shining example of, of somebody that needs to be institutionalized, it's Pimping Pat here, ladies and gentlemen. Now, what I'm going to be watching, it is not the whole video, it's just one of the segments, because quite honestly, this video is kind of dark now i don't mean like dark oh my god it's hard to see no i mean fucking dark like this guy's a fucking psychopath <laughs> but anyway so let's switch over to that shall we there we go okay so i'm actually going to try this without any blue without uh bluetooth earbuds i have the setting hopefully it's it's gonna work and i'll see how it goes in post edit so let's do this three two one I don't even, like, what the fuck just happened, dude? So this kid, who's getting paid $8 an hour to drive Uber Eats. Wait, hold on. Uh, is this one? And hold on, guys. Uh, okay, hold on. Let me. Yeah, here we go. $8, right? He said. Eight dollars, ladies and gentlemen. Eight dollars. Do I need to zoom in a little bit more? Eight dollars, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry, I just had to kind of point that out. I just had to point that out. There you go. Okay. And Which is a shitty job. He's getting paid to deliver shitty fast food. He calls me on my private phone to, to say, hey, they don't have what you ordered. Do you want me to bring it anyway, or do you want to cancel? This, I, think this, I think this is all in this guy's head, to be honest. They don't have you, what you ordered. Do you want me to bring it anyway? When I first watched this video, I'm like, huh? I like, like, literally, I'm like, huh? You know? Uh. And I say, I want to cancel. So he says, great, cancel it on the app. And I say, I don't know how, not my problem. Don't come to my house, cancel the order. I do not know how to use the app. You ordered from the app, dipshit. <laughs> Seriously, is this the, the this is the intelligent the intelligence of the uh common intelligence of the people that Phil Burnell is attracting apparently. I don't know how to cancel. I use the app to order stuff. I don't know how to cancel. 
Oh my god, we as a species are fucked. <clears throat> but you work for Uber. Your job is to work for Uber. And I said, no order. That means don't come to my house. He ignored my calls. I don't think it's a driver's uh, responsibility to... Uh... To cancel it, isn't it the the or, the person who orders it? Isn't it their job to cancel it? It isn't like unless if it's like let's use uh, Amazon for example. I order a lot of uh, Transformers related items from Amazon. Unless the pre let's let's talk about pre orders. If the pre order is they don't have enough pre orders, they can cancel it that way. But normally, if it's like a common item. The person ordering the item has to cancel it. I, I... He ignored my messages, explaining not to come to my house. And he... Oh, God. Now we know where Phil gets upset being ignored. House. If I tell you not to come to my home, and you act like you're going to drive to my fucking home, I will fucking kill you. Okay, this 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 took an awfully dark turn, ladies and gentlemen. All of this over this guy's uh, apparently his order of thirty-two gallons of lube, fourteen pounds of gummy bears, and a partridge in a pear tree. Apparently, his order did not go through, so he's about to have a fucking mental breakdown, ladies and gentlemen. No excuse. I don't give a fuck about the app. I don't give a fuck about the eight dollar an hour. Fa if you come to my fucking house when I told you not to, it's a felony, and I'm suing fucking Uber Eats. Uh, dude, you ordered all this stuff. How's he gonna bring it to you? If you didn't cancel it, the order's gonna go through. <laughs> oh my god, I I knew I knew DSP. Fans were stupid, but I didn't know they were this fucking stupid. I'm suing you for sending a fucking assassin to my house. Assassin! <laughs> you think it's a joke. Like, I'm too angry to be calm about it, but, like, I'm fucking furious, dude. They're not helping, dude. They're not doing their fucking job. Their driver just fucking threatened to come to my Dude, you ordered... You ordered a fucking whip, a baseball helmet, and and 64 pounds of sausage. I don't know why you're so upset. The order's coming, dude. Well, like, what the fuck? My fucking house. I would have. It would have been my legal right to bash his fucking face in for fucking self defense. If I tell you not to come to my house and you. This guy doesn't realize that if the, if he did place his order. How's the stuff going to get there, ladies and gentlemen? Dude, it's Uber Eats. It's fucking Uber Eats. It's a fucking conglomerate corporation. It's a fucking corporation. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. It's a fucking corporation, dude. Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious? How in the fucking fuck do I get a fucking agent? <laughs> Oh my god, this guy, you remember, oh god, I can't recall, uh, Spinal Tap. He's like, our, 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 the, the, the dial goes past 10 or whatever it was. This guy's fucking, like, past 20. This guy's off the fucking chart. No wonder Phil, you know, he, he, he gets money, he gets money from these idiots. Holy shit. On the fucking phone. Right fucking now! How in the fuck do I get a fucking agent? <laughs> I, 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 when I originally watched this, when I originally watched this, I was actually halfway expecting to hear somebody pound on a door and say, What the fuck are you doing in there? Shut the fuck up! <laughs> and then he replied me like, Okay, Dad. Or okay, mom, I'll I'll be quiet. Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> uh, this guy, this guy is fucking mental. Fucking mental. 
on the fucking phone right fucking now! What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? It's okay, Wrinkles. It's not your fault. I'm sorry. I'm traumatizing my cats. This guy has fucking animals with him. I fear for these pets of his. If he gets this upset about his order of bestiality porn, I am, I'm afraid for his pets, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, dude, I'm fucking furious. You're gonna fucking come to my house when I tell you not to come to my fucking house? I'll beat the fucking shit out of you. I'll fucking kill you. Don't fucking come to my house. He thinks he's still playing Call of Duty. <laughs> oh, he still thinks he's playing Call of Duty. <laughs> uh. When I tell you not to come to my house? Are you fucking serious, dude? Connect me to a fucking agent right fucking now. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice. Yo Oh, they did it now! <laughs> they did it now! They're, they're gonna get his wrath now! They put him on- they put him on hold, ladies and gentlemen! Or voicemail. Oh, I am about to beat the fuck out of this guy. If this guy comes to my house, I'm gonna beat the fuck out of this guy, dude. Why would I not be shocked that... If the delivery driver came to the house, this guy would literally act like Phil Burnell and find the farthest room away from that entrance and fucking hide. And and they hang up. They hang up. Oh god, it's on now. The fucking, the fucking help guy said I can't I can't talk about it anymore. The number hangs up. So the, so they just rule the world? So you just can't talk to anybody? So they just rule the fucking world? He's Psycho Sid! He's the master and the ruler of the universe and the world! <laughs> Holy shit, this guy. If it wasn't for the fact that this guy's probably a psychopath, he could be. He could have a good uh, career as a stand up comedian. But the fact is, this guy's probably a psychopath who skins and eats his pets. So your eight dollar an hour fat is gonna threaten me, and I can't do anything about it? Are you fucking serious right now? My voice doesn't sound. I'll never have the same voice ever again. I'll never have the same voice. We are literally at like Derek levels of of incompetence here, ladies and gen gentlemen. I'm so fucking furious right now, dude. I'm so fucking furious right now. I can't fucking call this fucking piece of shit. I can't fucking call these people. Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious right now, dude? Are you fucking serious? <laughs> I can't talk to them. I can't talk to them, dude. <clears throat> it's a felony, and I'm suing fucking Uber Eats. I'm suing you for sending a fucking assassin. Assassin's ladies. This guy needs a fucking padded room. Stack. Preferably one next door to fucking DSP. <laughs> into my house. And you think it's a joke, like... Okay, ladies and gentlemen. That was, that was it. That was it. Uh, yeah. Wow, I knew... I knew. Hold on, let's let's do this. There you go. I knew Phil Burnell had some had some troubled uh, fans, but you know, troubled. You know, we knew that. You know, poor Jade. He's probably gnawing on a sh his shin right now while sitting in his wheelchair. We got OIC who is contemplating becoming a furry cross-dressing woman. We have Derek. We, we just don't talk about Derek. And we got Pat Pimp or Pimp Pat or whatever his fucking name is. It's like a menagerie, ladies and gentlemen. It's a, it's a fucking menagerie of, of a whole bunch of shit. You know, like, holy fucking hell. 
But yeah. Like I said, if it wasn't for the fact that this guy probably kills skins and eats prostitutes, I would think that he was just, just a funny ass motherfucker that like a you know that he's just ribbing on DSP gaming. But I don't think that's the case. I think this guy's a fucking psychopath. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that is it. As always, click that subscribe button. Let's felt fill. Let's get him all angry and everything, you know, because, you know, as long as he's angry, hell, I'm having a good night. My name is Jeff, a.k.a. G Curse, wishing you all a great evening. Stay safe and watch out for your pets if you live in that guy's neighborhood. Peace out.